call them shit. Hold on, hold on, calm down. Let's tell those people the story from the beginning. No, not THE beginning. So, there is this challenge going on between me and that annoying little red fed mob about building a robot that avoids spilling beer. So, I wanted to create something unique. Something he has never seen before. So, after some research, I found this interesting experiment on YouTube. So, I decided to try it out. I made this simple magnetic stirrer to see if it works. And it didn't. The water level gets extremely high during rotation. That would waste the precious liquid gold before it even started. So after a lot of embarrassing moments that my wife really enjoyed, <laughs> the final version was ready. May I introduce you the beer mill. So let's dive into the details. First, we need some sort of a gimbal to give the cup its freedom during rotation. Two ball bearings in each direction allowed the cup to move freely in these directions. Of course a gimbal would have done the job, but that's too simple and above all not unique or funny. A weight of 0.5 kg on the counter side is definitely necessary, otherwise it would look like this. Then here comes the shaft for the rotation. Since everything is 3D printed, it has to be fixed with a lot of screws to increase its stiffness. Here we have the motor flange mounted with two ball bearings to ensure a frictionless rotation. Then the motor is mounted to the flange. We have this huge housing for the electronics. It allows to hold the device comfortable with one hand. For the electronics we have a motor driver and an Arduino. The Arduino allows us to accelerate and deaccelerate the motor by pushing the start stop button. So that's it. Improvements? Who wrote this down? Must be the red fed mock. Okay, I don't think that someone would like to build this robot, but just in case, you can see from my hand movement that the unbalancing torque is still high. To avoid muscle pain, I would improve that. Disadvantages? It starts to get really annoying. Well, also with this concept, the liquid level gets high during rotation. So with a full cup of beer, there is always a bitter loss. But the main disadvantage might be the huge thing rotating in front of your face. I like my beer. Shaken, not stirred. Or is it the other way around? Doesn't matter. I really hope you enjoyed this video, in spite of my sleepy voice. And I would like to invite you to join us on our journey. There will be a lot of crazy concepts and a lot of disappointments for the Red Fed Mock.